Hello everyone, this is Deb from uh, the Stampin' Hut. Um, I am bringing you another card using a Flourishing Phrases. But only what I am using this stamp set is with the matching framelits, or thin thinlets, um, that coordinate with the stamp set. And I'm using this small flower and this small leaf for this card that I am going to create for you tonight. So let's get started. Um, what you're going to need is to run these uh, two pieces, uh, your two thin lids through the Big Shot to get your little flowers and uh, your little flower, flower and your leaves. Okay? And you'll need a uh, sentiment, so I'm using Sweet Sayings and I'm using Celebrate You. So let's get started. What you're going to need is a card base and I'm using Sweet Sugar Plum and it's cut at five and a half by eleven, scored at four and a quarter. Basic Black, which is four by five and a quarter. And a piece of Whisper White, which is three and three fourths by five. And then I cut a half inch by two and a half inch strip for um, these three colors, the emerald, emery, em, emerald, I uh, tongue tied, emerald envy, sweet sugar plum, and ba basic black. And what you're going to do with these is just cut and make little tails out of them, out of all three because they're going to go on the front of your card and it doesn't matter if they're not the same um, because it uh, you're going to layer them a little bit on the card so it doesn't matter if they're even or not or the same tail size or whatever. So what you're going to do first is take your basic black and you're going to mount it to the front of your card. Put that right in the center. And then you're going to set this aside and you're going to work on this. The only thing we're stamping is going to be your sentiment and I'm using Memento Black Ink. We're going to stamp that right about here. Okay. Then you're going to take your flags that you had cut your tails and you're going to put some adhesive on it and layer them over here and then you're going to do one on top of each other don't worry about getting it to the top because we're going to cut the tops off even with the white piece Now flip it over, take your snips, and just cut along the white of the top of the card. And then you have your strips there. The best glue I found for these is our fine tip glue pen. And you're going to take off the top, and it's very fine tip. And there's a very, it's like a needle stuck in here. That is so that you can guide it through this tip to keep the glue flowing and so that it doesn't uh, get all gunked up in there for you and you can't get it out. So what you're going to do is take your flower and just put a little 
On, I only use the centers. That way I can put the leaves where I want them. But I just did the center of the flowers or the flower. Gonna lay that down in the corner. Then you're gonna do a leaf. And then you can slide that right in under the one end of the flower. And do the same thing for the other one. And that will go right underneath here, like so. So then before we put it on the front, I'm going to take our Emerald Envy marker, Stampin' Right marker, uh, and fill in the leaves right here for you. Just gives it a little more pop to the card, a little more color. And it brings out the green of the leaves and the strip that we made over here. Then you're going to add it to the front of your card. Like so. And the last thing we're going to do is put some rhinestones on. One in the middle of the car, uh, of the flower. And then we're going to put some just randomly around the front. There you have it. I hope you enjoyed the video and you come back. I will have another stamp set to feature two cards for that one. Thank you and have a wonderful evening.